How is everybody doing today? I am on time. That is not true at all. And why <clears throat> is that? Well, I had to set this up. I had to get with the guy who made it to set it up at like 9 in the morning. And then on her way out, Jillian goes, Oh, by the way, I didn't get a chance to walk the dog today. She doesn't usually walk the dog on Tuesdays. But I thought she was going to walk the dog. And she was like, can you walk the dog? And I was like, no. But I did. Because, like, what, am I going to explain to Sadie? Daddy's very busy. Daddy has to get up and read one new card today. Fascinating layout. Jumbo Josh is green on the layout. I don't like it. <laughs> There's separate boxes I'm going to scream. I like that they're separate boxes. You all will get used to it. Uh, the part I'm really excited about um, is... Uh, well, I need someone to, like, subscribe or something. Could someone please give me some money real quick? No, okay. Folks, Twitch Prime. Okay, thank you, Naraxis. Look at that. Oh, that's not big enough. I want it bigger than that. Wee! There it is. Check that out. Let's make it a little smaller, though. That's that's maybe too big. <clears throat> yeah, I like. I am of two minds about the box, the chat box. I like the I like the um. The picture. I like the alert widget. I don't love the chat box. We'll work on the chat box for sure. No sub sound? Oh, there should be a sub sound, but my dumbass didn't put them up. We're so loud, huh? I don't know what that means. There we go. Okay, well, that one's your fault for having a long name. <laughs> 17 ads showed up right as you asked for a sub, so here it is. That's true. Did you beat the bird lady from yesterday? You know what's amazing? Uh, I... Thank you, my feet small for the five. That's what I wanted. It was a sub from someone named my feet small. <clears throat> And Hensky, thank you for the five gifties. When does the new Garden of Band or Peak Peak game come out? I don't know. I thought it was going to come out Saturday, but it didn't. Ugh. I'll put the sub sounds on after after this stream. Um. So to those of you who were wondering about fucking uh the um. The bird lady, I did beat her. I literally beat her like under an hour after getting off stream. It, it It's like super lame too. So, you know, I don't think I got any better at the fight. I maybe got a little bit better at the fight uh, near the end. But like, all it was was like, I just had to go back to the... Or I, I had to, rather than just bash my head in the wall, go back and like consolidate my healing items. And as soon as I had like... The, the fight we were doing, I had two floral cupcakes, and those were my big healing items, and then everything else was like 30s or below. I just bought out the 30s, and like, um, I didn't realize gunpowder was a healing item, so I took that, and then I had a third floral cupcake, and I just walked in and fucking did it in like two. Undertale yellow stream topic is set? Well, you know, what? Wait. That's not true. It's just chatting. It was, You're literally lying. Unless you left the stream open from last night, in which case, thank you. I love lying. But yeah, it was it was upsetting. Um, I don't know. I I don't know. I, I mm, I've written down. <coughs> Hold up. 
<clears throat> I've written down a lot I want to talk about relative to that game, but unfortunately my brain is broken in such a specific way now that I think the most effective way for me to, uh, to actually talk about it is just to ramble. Like, it's, I'm trying to put pen to paper and, like, write a video, but I'm like, the video is either going to be, like, bullet points and three hours long, or it's going to be just a ramble on stream. <clears throat> I think you don't want to do a video about it. You want to talk with someone about it. Yeah, I mean... No, because I don't want someone to have to sit through three hours of a discussion. Um, but I will upload a video that's just me rambling also. TLDR, did you like it? It was okay. I... I think it's a really good kind of touchstone as to where we are culturally. Because it's all of the, like, I love when we go by the NBT building. NBT... I love, uh, it, it's got all the trappings of, like, a capital U Undertale game with none of the underlying questions, none of the interesting discussion. Like, things are just happening because they're cool and they happened in Undertale. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> uh... Someone was a fan of Undertale, but not a big fan of reading. You know, I hate to do this. I hate to do... It's not everything, but it keeps being many things. The divide between the people who made Undertale yellow and the people who made Undertale is the divide between the people who made Homestuck and the people who liked Homestuck. It's the divide between the people who watched The Simpsons and the people who made The Simpsons. It's the oldest dichotomy in the history of time. The binary between the people who have the ideas and the people who think the ideas are cool but can't quite put their finger on why. What is the divide between the people who made Deltarune and Undertale? Uh, money? Deltarune's fine. I'm super excited for it. Oh, man. It was so cool that it took, like, a day to figure out the uh, the weird route. And, like, I played it day one. Not the weird. I played the game day one. I was like, that was really good. And then day two, people were like, oh, you will not believe what we found last night. Ah, it was fun. I wish we could have more fun like that. But now, as soon as you download a game, you can just find everything in it. <clears throat> Deltarune is made by the same people who made Undertale. Well, yeah, but now they're richer. They're a little, mmm, richer. I don't know. The number one weird thing I, I don't get about <laughs> Yellow is, why did they put in the genocide route? Like, what? <laughs> they just wanted to show off that they could make cool bosses. And it's like, you don't have to, you just put that in... Put that in the base game. <laughs> because people like killing. People can like killing. But they're not making... Like, the reason there's the killing route in Undertale is because it's making a point about, like, content consumption. And in this one, they don't make that point. They're just like, what if, like, by killing you could access a bunch of really cool bosses? And it's like, yeah, I mean... I'm, I'm in. D-Rag, I think he walked it back. I think he's just doing three and four at the same time. All right. Is everybody... We, we, we are not going to do freaks, per se. But I do want to talk about something that happened recently. Uh, this is uh, really scary shit. Let me see if I can pull up a video. So I'm going to show a video that has a whole bunch of people dying in it. 
Uh, you can't really see it though. Um, let me, is it in my messages? It is not. Yeah, here it is. So this is, uh, this is real scary. So this is the, uh, the Baltimore, uh, Harbor Bridge. Um, I, I use this bridge like on a bi-weekly basis. Uh, you know, there's a, there's a beach around it where you can see the bridge. So this was at about, I want to, is one thirty in the morning yesterday. Uh, so the short of it is what happened, uh, is this tanker right here, uh, lost power and then it, it gets the power back, right? Uh, in, in a couple seconds here. Uh, and they like turn as fast as they can. Uh, but there's like, something's on fire and breaking and the power goes out again. And they get it back, but a little too late. Uh, and they hit this support column. And in hitting the support column, the bridge just goes. It goes like immediately too. Look at that. Holy fuck. So, um, if you'll notice, if you go back and check, the bridge does have, you see when this, these red lights start going up? I think that's like them telling people to stop or something, but like, by the time it hits the thing, there is no one using the road to travel. But as you can see, there are uh, a significant amount of like construction and I think police presence there. Um, and I mean, they just go. And uh, they've been uh, they've been looking for people since last night. Uh, they've found I think six people who are who are uh, dead. It is it's horrifying. It's like the a uh, uh, horrifying. Uh, scary ass tragedy um and oh man i this is what it ends up looking like the bridge is very big and i i hate to be like it's not that bad but like it is good that the collapse stopped like it's it's good that the collapse like was very localized. It's good that it happened at 1:30 in the morning. It's good that they were able to mostly keep people off the bridge. But oh man. New irrational fear unlocked. Yeah, I think the other thing that's scary is like you know, like 9-11, it's a, it's a real psychic thing, too. Because, like, this bridge is, like, it's a big fucking deal, right? Like, it's a huge, it's a huge landmark. Imperial decay setting in. I don't think it's, I don't think it's that. It's the boat lost power. I mean, the bridge was, the bridge is fine. And the fact that the collapse was localized, I think, really speaks to a, a great engineering feat. But it did get, you know, an entire pillar just ran over by a boat. Uh, the horrifying uh, part of this for the future is that this is going to take 100 years to fix. Is that this is never going to get fixed. And uh, in the meantime, it is going to be impossible to drive anywhere relative to Baltimore or to... Uh, to Mar to anywhere else in Maryland, so we'll see. And there's already conspiracy people saying shit like DEI did this and China did this because we banned TikTok. It's awesome. The, the DEI thing is so fucking funny that people have built like a mental model. Whenever something bad happens, it's like black people's fault. That's like really, really awesome. That's that's going to turn out really well for just society in general. Is like, oh, there was a catastrophic loss of life. This was like women's fault. It's so good. Like, I don't know, not to be not to be not to, you know, dick suck the government or whatever here, but it looks like every like they did everything they could. 
collapse was localized. They got everyone off the bridge. It looks like the people who went in were the like people who were cordoning off that portion of the bridge. But no, actually, I think that maybe there was a black guy on the boat, so it was their fault for some reason. Ugh. This is good. Westmore confirms the ship's crew issued a mayday and communicated they're experiencing a power outage. Uh, transportation officials then halted traffic over the bridge. Holy. Oh. I, I made the mistake of reading the comments. This is th this guy's getting fucked. Um, wouldn't they cast an? Oh wait, what the fuck happened to chat? Um, hello. Wait, what the what's going on here? Is there like a refresh? Help! 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 Did that fix it? Yes. Okay. Thank God. Anyway, um, I made the mistake of reading the comments and a significant amount of the comments were like, why didn't they just put down the anchor? <laughs> yeah, dude, for sure. Um, there were literally still cars crossing the bridge when it was hit. No. Ugh. Why didn't they just stop, man? My uncle has a boat. He can stop it. That's so true. If the Titanic had dropped the anchor, it would have stopped from sinking. I agree. It's just a really scary fucking day. <laughs> Really horrifying, debilitating event. All right, we actually have to get a fucking move on here in terms of uh, the stuff that we're going to do today. So, are there new cards, PogChamp? Let's actually see. Uh, ugh. No. Uh-oh. There's new card. Okay, I'm in. Uh, a lot of cool new, uh, rush cards. Where is the new card? It was on page one. It's the normal monster. Are you fucking with me? I can't do the I can't do the normal monster. Oh my god. Or can I actually? <clears throat> yeah. Sorcarada? Yeah, we'll do that too. New what the fuck? What's wrong with the chat box? Oh my good gracious. Alright, I'm gonna do it one more time, and then if it fucks up one additional time, we're gonna go back to the old chat box for today. And then I'll I'll send them a thing that's like, hey, the chat box no worky. Did people figure out a way to break it, by the way? 
The dynamic scaling breaks when people post certain things. All right, chat. You know how to do it. We're, we're, we're just going to do a live tech support stream here. Uh, how do we break it? When someone posts a message that's too long, it breaks the border of it. Okay. Fixed it. Figured it out in one. Yep. Augur has already broken it. That's literally it. All you have to do is type one really long word. Okay, let's let's throw it back. Okay, now let's try posting <laughs> or or sev it breaks if you put a bunch of emotes in a row. That's not good news. <laughs> okay, let's try it. Oh my god. Okay, stop posting a bunch of notes in a row or a, a bunch of emotes in a row. Let's just try it with a long message. Let's do the 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 sword soul copy pasta. Oh, does that break it too? Oh, that's a real problem. No, it can do long messages. Yeah, that looks fine. Uh, but as soon as someone posts a, a sequence of uh, multiple PPs, it's just gone. All right. <laughs> Everyone wave bye-bye to the chat box. Bye-bye, chat box. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, we tried. Uh, themes and overlays. Wait, how do I do this? Fuck. Um, hold up. You're going to be purple again, chat. You're going to be purple. I know you don't want it, but that's that's what's going on. That's the truth of the matter. That's life. Oh fuck. Wait, no. Ugh, I don't want to do this on stream. This is like a huge, annoying problem. Uh, no, that's not it. Um, no chat today. I don't want to do no chat today. Did I put it in my downloads? Where did I put this fucking thing? Uh, no. Um, open file location. Twitch panels, maybe? No, that's not it. Oh, fuck. How did I do this? Oh. <laughs> maybe it was untitled? Just stream on Danny's account. That's a good idea. Okay, now let's try it. Oh, I maybe didn't click save last time. 
Oh, I didn't click save. Oh my God. No, no shot that that's what happened. I did everything right and they indicted me. All right, wh whatever. I we're just going to do this for the the present moment. It's just boring old chat from 2015. Ugh. Pro streamer, by the way, totally. All right, ready? New cards, Pog Champ. New cards, Pog Champ. We actually only have one new card, and it's a vanilla. Anyway, thanks for clicking the video. Uh, so we're beginning with Absurd Void Hole. Damn, that hole got me acting absurd. Oh. Okay, next up. Uh. They made Summon Source Woke. So uh, Summon Sorceress is a Link 3 that says special a monster from your deck. It is probably the number one card that can never be removed from the ban list. Anyway, they just removed it from the ban list. Now, why did they do that? It's because they gave it an errata. Two non-token monsters with the same type. If this card is Link Summoned, you can special summon a monster from your hand. In defense position to a zone your opponent or your opponent's zone this card points to negate its effects. Then you can special summon one monster with the same type as that monster from your deck in defense position. And if you do that, you can't special for the rest of the turn except monsters with the same original type as the monster specialed from the deck. Uh, uh, this card is crazy. What the fuck? That... <laughs> What was the errata? So the errata was... So the errata was it was two separate effects. When you special it, it can summon to your opponent's side of the field. And then it can summon a monster with the same type as a monster that it points to, right? So if you had four material, you wouldn't have to special to your opponent's side. And now it also locks you into the same type as the monster that you summon. Um... I don't like this still is quite good. I the the thing that I think is going to prevent it from being played is at the moment I can't think of a deck that I would put it in. You know, like sure it is an independently powerful card, but it does still need a home rather than like the previous iteration of this card you would just throw the card in anything or you would build a deck that makes use of this card and you were at a disadvantage if you weren't doing that. Uh, it also now negates the monster summoned to the opponent's field. Oh, it didn't do that before? Right, because you could just fucking give them Nightmare. Uh, but yeah, there are a bunch of really annoying applications that people have already found. Uh, they found a 1.5 card uh, Christia Lock turn one. Uh, if you lock yourself in a fairy, uh, they found, um, Yogan is a really easy special. Uh, broken combo with the new errata Sork. All right, what are we working with? Do I have to play Pendulums? I feel like I really don't want to. Well, this is already an insane board, right? I'm not scared of that, but you know. <laughs> More fiend link shenanigans. I love that. I love this. OCG players literally day one, they're like, I figured it out. I figured out a combo. We got to do more of this shit. Listen to that. Listen to that banger track. 
Let's maybe listen a little quieter. All right, they're doing Fiendsmith stuff. Seven Spirit Gates is such a funny fucking card. All right. Let's get him going. Down he comes. This specific Fabled is getting so much play. Yama. Get back the Fiend Smith. Two sixes. B. B is so dead. Every time I see B recently, I'm, she's so dead. Fabled Bumblow. Oh my god, it's two parts. Oh, come on. <laughs> Okay, your ultimate nightmare. All of these effects. Mega Giga Nightmare. Terror Incarnate. Squirmer in hand. Unchained Trap. Fusion Summon. Squirm. <laughs> Doing zone math here. You bell for Terror Incarnate. Squirmer in the two for, I imagine, Sork. Yup. Give them Beckoning Beast. <laughs> Summon Sharvara. Pop Ultimate Nightmare. <laughs> this is... <laughs> I don't think this is uh, good. <laughs> this, this seems like a lot. What, Griffin? Yeah, literally, yes. Set the Unchained Trap. Damn, a second Beatrice. No, we make Wave here. And it only took us 15 cards in the extra deck. Um, this does not strike me as particularly good, I'm going to be honest with you. <laughs> it's like, what if Unchained played 18 million more bricks? Uh just to make summon sword resolve once like uh fiend link is already going to be playable i don't think that it like gains anything from this it's like no you don't understand now fiend link can go griffin lock um and rage and uh wave king high caesar when uninterrupted and it's like uh-huh that is not a change uh from what it was already doing um but i again i think this card is really good it's just gonna like it needs a home. There will have to be a deck that makes use of it. Um, but it's not too hard to imagine that deck. All right. Next up. Oh, man. I don't know about you. But I can't get blood to flow into my dick unless I hear about Yugi and Kaiba doing an epic duel. Blue eyes, white dragon, dark magician, dark magician girl, red eyes, black dragon, special summon effect. Dueling's 25th anniversary hits its stride with this year's tin, the 25th anniversary tin, Dueling Mirrors. Now, I know what you're thinking. What is going to be the theme? I've got great news for you. Mirrored back-to-back, -back, Yami Yugi and Seto Kaiba stand like giants over a series of iconic monsters from the Yu-Gi-Oh! anime series. While they're the world's greatest duelists, Yugi and Kaiba have always been mirrors of each other. Yugi relying on the unity of his team, and Kaiba relying on money. As always, Tin will contain three Mega Packs. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't last year's Tins also use the 25th anniversary branding? At what point is it no longer the 25th anniversary? What? When does the 25th anniversary end? I feel like we have to be... I'm pretty sure... <laughs> The opposite of money is friendship. Oh, poo. You're right. When we hit 30. <laughs> oh, man. When it's the year of Luigi. Yeah, true. I They should just start 30 at 29. Being like, 
It's the 30th anniversary. What the fuck are you going to do about it? Entering year three of our one year 25th anniversary. <laughs> it's like Toyotathon. This 25th anniversary. Get 0% APR on the 25th anniversary tin dueling mirror. They're like me pretending to be 22 seven years in a row. Why would you pretend to be 22, Leah? What do you gain from that? I got to pretend to be 22. Why? So the type of guy who like cruises around high schools will be interested in me. Men like that. Oh, maybe, maybe that actually is her justification. My bad. I didn't know. I didn't know it was like that. I will say this though. I, I know, I know Danny very well. So if you want to get with him, he hates, he hates people younger than him. He hates children. He is, he would, if, if, if it was legal, he would murder everyone under 25. So you're going to have to make a choice, Leah. Stay, <laughs> I'm 50 years old. <laughs> Stay attractive to the McConaughey's of the world or stay attractive to the Guadalupe's. That's why Danny is my number one streamer. That's very true. As always, each tin will contain three mega packs, multiple rarities guaranteed. This tin does away with some of the lower rarity slots to give everyone more of the higher rarity people are looking for. Just, just give us the OCG ratios. Clearly, we know what works here, and it's giving a whole bunch of shit to people at a billion rarities. You know what I'm... Okay, I didn't realize that this, this alert box was also going to highlight follows. Let's, um... Next person who follows, let's make a big deal of it. Let's be like... Sound off in chat. Like, let's make them very uncomfortable. Hold up. Let's let's just wait for someone to follow here together. Whoa! Houndour 5000. Thank you for the follow. Hey, sound off in chat. Is that how everyone say hi to Houndour 5000? What are we gonna what let's pretend that we're like one of those streams that like um what is it that like does the uh Welcome to the, and then like a group of, of people. Like what, what would our, <laughs> welcome to the bussy brigade. <laughs> I hope you have a great time. Yeah, we're a little, we're a little different than other streamers here. You know, we're a little wholesome, but sometimes we like to have fun, you know? <laughs> so hope you enjoy your time. Um, uh, <laughs> give me some money. <laughs> welcome to the goon sesh. We're in hour three. <laughs> Okay, all right. We'll keep the, the follow thing on. I think I actually know how to resolve the follower issue, and I will do it momentarily. But if you want your name up here <laughs> and us to make fun of you, you got about 10 minutes to follow until we're done with this segment. Uh, the best of 10 pulls together popular and sought-after cards from a dozen recent booster sets, including... Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. I can't keep reading. I just realized that Ecoin Yang followed. Wow, welcome... Welcome to the to the goon sesh. Welcome to the goon cave. Uh, make sure you know what actually sound off in chat. Uh, M the Rar. Sound off in chat. Who is your favorite character from Invader Zim? Who is your Who is your favorite character for in Invader Zim? Let us know in the chat. You have to tell us. If you don't tell us, you are not welcome here. Asshole Junior. Wow, thanks so much for joining, Asshole Junior. I'm so happy to have you in the community. You Asshole Junior, tell us your favorite episode of Rick and Morty or your band. <laughs> okay, all right, okay. This year's Best of Tin pulls together popular and sought-after cards from a dozen recent booster sets, including Power of the Elements. Oh, my God, okay. Uh, Photon Hype. Wait, hold up. Before. Oh, wait, this is actually a sub. Wait a minute. Random Vent, thank you for the sub. I've been talking a lot about these followers, and they are fucking nothing to me. They're lower than dirt. Freeloading, disgusting people sucking up Amazon's hard-earned bandwidth. But you, you're a true hero. And I don't use that phrase lightly. Hero is a term I reserve for the firefighters on 9-11, uh, Neil Armstrong, and you. 
for six months of giving me money. <laughs> Mr. Simpson, I don't say this often, but <laughs> I don't use the word hero often, but you are one of the greatest heroes in American history. All right. Photon Hypernova, Cyberstorm Access, Duelist Nexus, Age of Overlord, uh, Maze of Memories, Amazing Defenders, Wild Survivors, and more. Okay. That's that's good. I mean, a little a little upsetting that Phantom Nightmare isn't in there, but I understand they have to make money. Agov being in there is a big deal because there's a lot a lot in Agov that I think is is really important. Wait, hold up. I just Maze of Memories is not Maze of Millennia, right? No. So no bonfire, right? Okay. All right. That's fine. Whatever. Plus brand new art versions of and more. I love when people say this. It says and more. Oh yeah, they're just burying the lead that there's fucking <laughs> Phantom Nightmare in here. Power of the Elements, Photon Hypernova, Maze of Memories, and more. You'd be like in the Konami meeting like, no dude, don't lead with Phantom Nightmare. They need to know that the Gate Guardian reprints are coming. And more. <laughs> I love it. We put all the good packs outside of the press release. This is what people were telling me about Rarity Collection 2. Oh, don't worry. All the good reprints are in the and more. No, they're not. Plus, brand new art versions of some of Dueling's most famous cards from Red Eyes Black Dragon and Dark Magician Girl to Harpy's Feather Duster and Raigeki. Electivire 1990, 1980, holy shit, 1990, okay, Phew, someone I can respect, you shot the gap between person younger than me and Gen X individual, another group of people I cannot tolerate, Electivire 1990, how do you feel about this, Red Eyes Black Dragon, Dark Magician Girl, doesn't this sicken you, Electivire 1990, isn't this just disgusting that they are fucking pumping blood from dark magician girls fat titties every day to try why do we have so many viewers did josh host or something and i just missed it josh i'm so sorry yes all right well oh just now he rated josh we are we we're we're, we're a little out of our fucking mind today so we got a new alert box and a new little window here and a new chat box and the chat box broke immediately and we've learned the alert box shows follows. So <laughs> what we're doing today is it's is oh, this is neither here nor there. We are singling out every person that follows and being like, Hey, let us know how you feel. I love streams that do that. Hey, thanks for the follow sound off in chat. No. <laughs> Looks nice. Thanks. <laughs> I think it looks great. <laughs> Ravanth, thank you for the follow. Ravanth, do you think that it's cynical that we are just retreading the same disgusting dual monsters ground every six months until the fucking sun explodes? Doesn't that, Jack Omu, doesn't that piss you off that we cannot culturally advance past the point of the red eyes black dragon? Like, uh, this card already has nine alternate arts. And they're like, no, it's the 10th one that's going to get people to buy the QCR tins. Percy is here. How many DMGs can we truly tolerate? Not only do we have, like, two different DMG arts already, we already have, like, nine different retrains of DMG. Apprentice Illusion, Valkyria. How many times are we going to make this mistake? Shoo-gee-gee-gee-gee-gee-gee-gee-gee. If it's Blue Eyes and... Uh, Dark Magician, Kaiba and Yugi, why is Red Eyes and DMG getting the alt hearts? Where's Joey? Bubble. <laughs> Do you ever think about death, Bubble? Bubble, you ever think about death? Bubble is the thing that 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 causes you to lie awake at night. The fact that you'll miss so much. Celix, have you ever considered that the reason that we're afraid of death is because after death, we won't be able to experience the miracle of consciousness and the joy of life? You, your hair sniffer, do you ever see a press release like this and think, actually, I don't think I'm going to miss anything. 
I think that we are frozen in time, trapped in amber in the present moment. Panda Force Panda Force 809. Let me ask you. Is there a reason to fear death when we have proof that there's nothing to fear? Compliant Hornet, I know that you unfollowed and refollowed, so I would give you attention. Anyway, MBT Mathmex Circular, I hope you enjoy the 25th anniversary tin. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm sure it'll be fun. I'm sure it's a tin. I'm sure it'll be fun. I, I'm, sure it'll be, I'm sure it'll be I'm sure it'll be fun. I'm sure we'll have a good fucking time together. I I appreciate it. Mm. Can they design this tin more cute than the last one? What's the problem with the last one? For this new tin, they should have, you know, how how could we get boomers to buy this tin? Let's just put Dark Magician Girl hentai on it. I don't know. What what do what do fucking Yugi boomers like? You know what actually? Put the put the inflation DMG on it. You know what? Let's actually do it right now. All right, there's the there's the picture. I got it. Yeah, let's go to a twenty fifth anniversary tin. All right, there it is. Ooh, uh, let's just do a little bit of a remove .bg real quick. Get a version of this with no background. You know, theoretically, I could do this in client, but I'm not gonna. Uh, let's go be funky, rather than use a third party tool. Let's uh, open up uh, this, and then let's throw in the transparent over top over here, please. So this looks like shit, right? Looks awful. Like, oh my god, what is going on? There's so much happening. There's like a bunch of guys on it, right? But like, look at this. Uh, it's John Pork. You know, there is a version of this that I think is much more marketable uh, to the the general audience of uh, of Yu-Gi-Oh! And it's this. Uh, I honestly, I that to me, that seems like a pretty good tin design. I mean, I think that <laughs> I think, you know what, actually, we could even we could turn down the opacity. Look at that. Maybe it's just a hint like a like a lacrosse hint of DMG tummy. Would you buy that? <laughs> What if, what if uh, one in every forty thousand tins was like this? Like it was lenticular, and you like you move it in a certain direction, and all of a sudden, boom! A face full of DMG inflation. I honestly, you know what? Konami, hire me. I I'm just giving you legitimate money printer ideas. This <laughs> is. Oh man. Spunky commies. I I hope that you I hope that you're enjoying this uh this stream. I hope sound off spunky commies. Leah Azimov. Hey, how do you feel about this, Leah? What are you, are you buying this tin? Ugh. Are you using this tin as a weed tray? I got to ask you. Are you are you rolling on the fucking DMG tummy? I am. <laughs> this was good this was a good little oh right there's still one more card fuck okay hold up Woohoo! <laughs> what the fuck pity pity is the name of of this one pity a little cutie inside a glass flask who is said to be bring good luck to its contractor. However, the stopper must never be pulled out, no matter what. You must never, ever, ever. It's almost too easy, right? Like, what, what do you think I'm going to say? <laughs> you know? Uh, you know, there's even multiple avenues. You know, we've we've got the the little guy in the jar, but we've also got 
you know, uh, <laughs> you know, you must never pull out, you know, uh, I don't know. I don't like it. I do like Quacky Ducky, though. Why did they reprint Quacky Ducky? Were people like, I'm going to fucking die if I don't get the Quacky Ducky reprint? Oh. This sucks. Sophie, apparently. Thank you for the follow. Okay, let's turn off the follower alerts. This was a fun 15 minutes. Everyone say goodbye to the follower alerts. Uh, hold up, it's it's not gonna do this till I refresh. Wait, we got a Guido. A Guido. I just fucked the whole thing up. <laughs> uh, I just, the whole thing is fucked. I... <laughs> I'm never streaming again, man. I'm so bad at this. Holy fuck. We got a Guido. A Guido. Okay. Hi. Limited time offer. For the next rest of this stream, we're going to have the old sub sounds. And while that's going on, let's build our decks for the roulette finale. We've got, what, 15 minutes? Yeah, that's good enough. We got a Guido. A Guido. Gauge sub sound when? I think I'm... Don't... I can't guarantee it, but I think the multiple donos is Gage going, oh, MBT. But I'm not sure. I literally don't know. Okay. We have to delete some decks. We can delete this one. Now we don't have to delete any. What are we doing for the finale? So off stream, we have rolled uh, a wheel that contains every deck ever built for roulette. And we rolled it a bunch of times. And each of us has four decks from roulette's history uh, to play. So many Farfa decks. We actually got two of our four decks are fucking Farfa decks. Okay. First up is Doug's Blackwing deck. Uh, wow, he did not get very much. Uh, no thing the Starlight is in here, so we will have to craft that. Uh, wow, uh, two Black Whirlwind. That's that's pretty good. Uh, what is that? Cards for Black Feathers. Uh, this card, this card. Uh, he has three. He has one of this guy. Uh, one Bora. That's not good. Uh, oh, God. Uh, no copies of Shura. Is that... That's really how it works. Oh, he has one Shura. Um, where's Gladius? Oh, he has three Ouster, the south wind. That's kind of cool. I guess. Um, three Sirocco. That's a big deal, right? Where is Sirocco? Three of that guy. Uh, one Chris the Cracker of Dawn. That's fucked up. I th we're supposed to have more of that card. Um. Oh, he has three Kalutes. So we have that already. Two Gales. That's pretty big. Uh, one, two. What the hell is that? There's some guy I've never seen in my life. Is it this guy? No. It's like, wh where the hell is he? Is he a Blackwing even? He better be, because I'm not going to find him otherwise. Oh, it's this guy. Tornado the Tomato. 
Uh, he has a Simo. Simo, the poison wind. Uh, and then everything else is like non Blackwing stuff. So let's do the. <clears throat> he has two of this guy. He has two of this guy. He has one no thing the fucking starlight, which we will have to craft. He has one of this guy, Graham the Shining Star. Three Soya. What the hell is that? It's like a two of. It's not Raikiri. It's this guy. Kidori the asshole. One silver wind. One black wing dragon. Where is he? Where's black wing dragon? Oh, it's named something else. And then one... What the hell is that? I've never seen that one. That might not be a black wing. That is definitely not a black wing. What am I looking at? <clears throat> there is like a big, scary, super rare synchro. Is it wind? I can't tell. It's SR. Here, hold up. It's this one right by, uh, it's the 14th card in the extra deck. Dark Rage Dragon. That's annoying. Sure. Uh, and then outside of that, we have uh, Care Ass. We have Triple Burst. Triple Bursto. We have uh, uh, Red Moon. We have Gadarla. We have uh, Obelisk. We have Geh. We have Vice Dragon. We and got we Agito. have Agito. Agito. Fucking um. Shura. We have one Shura. And oh, we have um. Zeph. All right. That's good. One down. Someone keep a running tally of how many URs we're going to need. All right, next up. Oh, God, it's a fucking Farfa deck. Okay, it's the, it's the Raid Raptor one. Uh, so for Raid Raptor, he's playing, oh God. Oh, he really does not know what he's doing. That's okay. We can still probably win. Oh, he didn't, he didn't pull Raider's wing. No. Uh, triple fuzzy. We have like mimicry in here, right? We have three of this guy, two of this guy. Oh my god. Extra decks are sussy. Sussy Baka. Three of this guy. Two of this guy. I feel like I'm missing a lot of Raid Raptors here. There's Mimicry. Oh, he has three of the, or two of that. That's really good. Um, where is Lastrix? There he is. Lastrix, two I don't recognize. Those three, those three, those three. What the fuck? 
it's fiend the fiend link video just started playing again <laughs> clown jump scare legitimately um he's playing two of this guy boosting strix more like boosted strix he's playing one of this big scary guy necro vulture He's playing one of Strangle and then a bunch of bullshit. Uh, Rums, he's playing one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, seven, eight, nine. Readiness. Where the fuck is readiness? And whatever this one does. Okay. What are we missing? I think it's all free agents. Oh, except for this. We have two of this. Uh, and then for guys in the extra, we have four Strix also. We have... Oh, that's very silly. Um, three satellite cannon? Okay, whatever. Oh, uh, we have wise Strix. Uh, we have a card I've never seen in my life. That's got to be Rev Falcon. It is Rev Falcon. Um, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, he only has 13 cards in the extra. Okay, and then we have Moork. We have Black Eyes. We have Plasma. We have mandragora we have two more cards i don't recognize um what is the card here right next to mandragora to the left of mandragora it looks kind of like an evil swarm this one right here ketos We got a Guido. A Guido. Uh, and then we have missing something in this line. Oh, the third mimicry. We got a Guido. A Guido. All right. Okay, that one didn't even need any URs. Okay, now we get to play one of my decks, so this is going to be a good one. Uh, Chaos. Oh, shit. Maybe it won't be a good one. We're playing... A bunch of really bad cards in this. Um, three of this guy... Three of this guy. Uh, three of this card. One of this card. No, not that. One of this card. Ag. Uh, some number of the link. Two of the link, actually. Uh, how many super soldier? None. But we have two vanilla BLS. Uh, okay, now we have some problems because the rest of these are just chaos cards. They just like have chaos in the name. Uh, never mind, I found them immediately. Chaos and Master. Um... Chaos Sork, I have one of. Um, 
I don't know what the fuck that card is. Uh, said Chaos Emperor Dragon Envoy of the End. Where the fuck is that at? There he is. We also have Penned Said. Though I don't seem to find him either. We have two of this guy. Three Chaos Space. Uh-uh. No, no, no. Uh... Fuck. Um, this one's really hard, actually. Uh, I think I'm playing one of this guy. Yeah. We got three, a three, two, three. Oh, Wait. I put the wrong guy in for this. Three of him. We have Dark Flare. Solar Wind Jammer. Uh, Light Pulsar. Uh, Gaia the Dragon Champion. Gaia. Charging Gaia. Uh, Nessie. Some card I don't know. Uh, said to Chaos Master. Chaos Emperor, the Dragon of Domination. Oh, this is the guy I didn't know. Daedalus. Um, three, three, uh, Super Soldier. Okay, what is this trap card? It's this trap card I have three of here at the end. Something, something, night and day. That's it. Exchange of night and day. Thank you. And then butterfly yolk. Butterfly. Little big stack. Uh, fossil machine. Uh... Dragon Champion, Magical Dragon Knight. What the fuck is the name of the BLS Blue Eyes Ultimate? Dragon Master Knight. Word salad, these cards. Um... Muddy... Mussy, muddy mud dragon. Chaos. Uh, is it this one? Chaos goddess. Yes. Um. Uh oh. There is actually another chaos card that we are playing in here. Oh god, we even have a tuner. Fuck. <laughs> That's not good. I mean, it's good for us because it's it's a good card, but... All right, last one. Heraldic. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, he had three of this guy. I mean, it's another Farfa deck. Three far two Farfa decks. You know, he does have three of everything, I will say. Uh... Uh, 
And then he had two of this, two of this, three of this, two of this. What is that? Fucking terrors? Okay, um, it's got to be terrorists. Yeah. All right, what are these last cards in Farfa's deck? The last, like, trap cards? It's this one three of trap and then whatever this is. This, like, pillar? Heraldry something? And tower of something. You were right. Okay, the extra deck. Uh, he has two patriarch, one of Genom heritage. He has 169. Uh, one Dreadnought Dreadnoid. Fucking super rare? Uh, wow, I really don't recognize any of these fucking cards. Heart Earth. Uh, Sky Palace, Gangrudai, he has both of these, uh, Proxy F, and then nine cards I don't recognize. Okay, what, what are these? Uh, what's this third and fourth one? What are they? CXZ's Fairy Cheer. Perfect. That's not what it is. Though this is in the deck. CXE's Engineer. No. Also not that. Although Comics Hero Legend is in here. Mech whipped. You're right. Uh, one, two, one. There's one more uh, that I don't have in here. There's two more I don't have in here. It's the link that's not Proxy F and the guy right next to Fairy Cheer. This, like, red guy. Regular Heart Earth? What the fuck? This is regular Heart Earth. The other one? So there is. <clears throat> Alright, where are we in terms of URs? How many how many URs do we need? Five? Holy shit. So we have to disenchant fifteen cards here. Holy shit. One, two. Got 
Didn't need those. Didn't need those. I want the fucking... <laughs> How did we do that? We pulled like nine URs from out of pack and one from pack and it's the one that we're not playing. Isn't that crazy? That's like unbelievable. Well, now we have a lot we can disenchant at least. Okay, now we just got to find, what, nine more? Or, uh, five more? <laughs> One, <laughs> two. Now we'll leave a full go. Doug better pay me handsomely. Let's get a royal. Nope. Where is Doug? Is Doug, uh, is Doug streaming? God, if I had gotten a fucking... The screen is weird? Oh, yeah. Hold up. No royals. Oh, wait! We did get a royal! Holy shit! Okay, it was all worth it. It was all worth it. This card is so bad. What the fuck? This is like the... We'll take it. We will take it. It's a generic synchro. It's a tier card. True. Oh, we actually, because this was a Farfa pack, we get the free pull. Here we go. What are we hoping for, chat? Exactly what we wanted. Mm. Let's fucks with the accessories real quick.
You know what? Let's actually not, right? We want to maintain an advantage by using the same one for everything. Oh, if we're going to use the same one for everything, it's got to be the ghost trick field and the... The Dune Popcorn Bucket. I've been to the theater three times and I haven't seen the Dune Popcorn Bucket once. It's fucked up, right? I really want the Popcorn Bucket. You can get them used on uh, on eBay, but like, I don't want a used one. I want a new one. You know, I don't want to be someone's second time, right? I want like a, a beautiful, pristine, untouched, unblemished, nubile <laughs> popcorn bucket. <laughs> What? No, come on. It's not for... It's to fuck. Come on. It's not for anything gross. We got Aguido. Aguido! Where is that fucking guy? All right, let me do the... Uh, let me do the profiles for him. <clears throat> All right. All right, so here are our four deck pile. All right, so here are our four deck profiles. There we go. All right, so here's our four deck profiles. Uh, our first one comes courtesy of Doug. It is his black wing list, and uh, truth be told, it looks fine. Um, there's not a lot, you know. You don't need to reinvent the wheel on black wing, but uh, I am a little concerned that we don't have like the right number of sure the blue flame uh two black whirlwinds big sea moon's big soroka's big I feel okay about it next up is a farfa list heraldic uh this i am super concerned about we are permitted to lose one and i imagine it'll be this they're good cards in heraldic leo's strong basilisk is strong and we have decent payoffs in like patriarch and genom heritage but uh Largely, I think this is going to not go well. Thankfully, I am playing one of my own decks in Chaos, and this is a nice list. Uh, I remember that we uh, unfortunately we didn't pull... I remember that we unfortunately didn't pull any Super Soldier, but we did pull Soldier Soldier. Kind of a little bit of an unbalance when it comes to uh, the White Knight and the Black Knight. I wouldn't read more into it. Oh, wow. The dragon as well. What the fuck? I had to craft two chaos rulers for this, so you better appreciate it. And then finally, we have another Farfa list. What are the chances? Two... He was on, what, 10 episodes? Two of them? We, we have to play two of his decks. Uh, this is Raid Raptor. Um, he's just playing all the good Raid Raptor cards. I'm, I'm fine with this. I like playing Raid Raptor. All right, let's school this fool. All right, let's school this fool. Cha -cha. Where's Doug? Gold darn it, where's Doug? Lost internet? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Got a Guido. Guido. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Da -da -da.
Read subs while you wait. No. <laughs> People get so mad when I read subs. I <laughs> Dice okay, one, two, three, four, thank you for the sub. Uh no mo no more creativity, thank you for the gifty. Coach Dad, thank you for the sub. Uh Radical Gamer for the win, thank you for the fifteen. Omega Metroid, thank you for the nineteen. Constro, thank you for the sub. Tenkai the Mixion, thank you for the 18. You Bell Scrap Ass, thank you for the 7. Kaishibu Kai, thank you for the Prime. Big M222, thank you for the 40. Holy fuck. Woody Nichua, thank you for the 15. Some Fat Guy's Arm, thank you for the 5. Woodward James, thank you for the 8. Not Math Mech Circular, thank you for the sub. Shadowed Riot, thank you for the 14. Adobe MS Paint, thank you for the 29. Random Ven, thanks for the 6. Joshua Schmidt, thank you for the raid. There it was. Peeps, thanks for the 48. Rixa Yu-Gi-Oh, thank you for the Prime. Forest Kawhi Healer, thank you for the 30. Send Ab Zero for cost, thank you for the 1,000 bits. They used to call me absurd whole change in college class. That's what I'm saying. No more creativity, thank you for the 5. Send Ab Zero for cost, thank you for the 20. Shadow Kirby, 25, thank you for the 8. Finder the Ice Wing, thank you for the 8. Mr. 161, thank you for the 7. Hensky, thanks for the 5 gifties. Storm Typhius, thank you for the Prime. And we're caught up. I lied. Guntum, thank you for the 23. Where the fuck is Doug? No more creativity. Thank you for the gifty again. We got a Guido. A Guido! We got a Guido. A, a Guido. Guido. We got a Guido. A Guido. Why do you have 12 uncleared missions? Man, mind your own fucking business. That's why. Hey. Well, well, well. Here we are. Would I? I don't even want to say it, but I, my my piece, my com internet did crash ten minutes. Oh no! Undo every cord, and it seems stable now. But it's like, what a day, right? The most important day ever. <laughs> yeah. And uh, not working, not working. Not okay. a good omen in general. My um, my chat broke as well. Oh shit! What a great um, start to the most important stream I've had in two Hold up, let me. I have to do this. Oh, I see. Doug, thanks for the twenty. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Got a Guido. A Guido. Um. Okay. I, I am on my main account here, so I'll send you a little invite. But we you're on your main. Yeah, yeah, and I actually crafted a Royal Rare Vampire Frawlin while I was both oh! crafting. So, you know, that would have come in handy in the Royal Rare duels. <laughs> I got I think there's honest. no out to that card. I got a Royal Rare in um Black Feather Dark Rage Dragon. Are you familiar with that what card? What is that? <laughs> It's like evil. It's like an evil fucked up Blackwing Dragon. Just a glimpse into my Oh, oh yeah, reality. you made like a <laughs> Yeah. Drew a little angry face on on purpose. Mm -hmm. All right. So remember, we have four decks available, and you have to win with three different ones. Otherwise, three of no, the four decks. Quest. I don't know, man. I don't think I can win with one of the four decks. <laughs> I think my decks are not very good. <laughs> I, You know, I have three of your decks, and they're really strong. Like, your pulls have been incredible. Yeah, I'm. I, so. I, I think that maybe there's another... <laughs> No, you know, Doug, I got to say, I have one of your decks, one of my decks, and then two of uh, one Nadir Mazzoni's decks, and that individual's oh, decks are not okay. very strong at all. I'm going to be honest with you. Yeah, yeah. No, that's fair. You know, you get to suffer a little bit. My boy had a rough go of it. <laughs> yeah, I, you know, I was living through it. <laughs> I, I was living through it. 
Oh boy. Um, we'll just see what you're playing. You can go first. <laughs> All right, dude. Let's see what I'm playing as well. Just randomly queue up stuff. Oh, this is just how this deck functions, isn't it? Damn. Okay, I'm okay, glad it wait. carried this, over. It's actually oh. That's something cool. Um, not targets for this or what? Uh, got a big combo. Oh yeah. <laughs> Whoo! It's been. It's been a long two and a half years <laughs> of playing roulette. <laughs> Man, okay. So you open this every fucking time, and I'm glad it's staying true. I'm going to normal summon Elemental Hero Stratos. No, baby. Come on. <laughs> Cousin of Stratos. We don't, we don't need to do this, man. We don't need to. Okay. Let's see. Let's just take a look at your extra deck real quick. Um, okay, okay. Uh, man, I don't even know. Probably this guy, right? Not as easy as it looks, is it, Doug? <laughs> it really, you know, I tried running through the combos beforehand with some of these decks, and it's really not easy. They don't tell you that in the prep, but... Oh, this looks pretty easy, actually. I'm going to be honest with you. This uh, looks pretty easy. <laughs> yeah. This one, you know, might be a little easier, but this hand was kind of nuts. This deck's crazy. Jesus man. Christ, Doug! <laughs> oh, I'm dead! I'm dead on board! <laughs> oh, no. Okay, hold up. Oh, my God, dude. Okay. Oh, oh liquid, These cards are man. nuts, dude. Like, oh, my yeah, welcome God. Yeah, to, welcome to my world. Welcome to Heroes. Um, you know, okay. you can play this in Constructed, too. Yeah, I can literally bring this deck into constructed. You are right. All right. I don't know if you got like Go! or something, so I'll just <laughs> I'll just keep going. You know how? Oh wait, it's fine. The only dark monster <laughs> that was I have there. Is the little bit of a Esquire. mistake. I was like, I don't know if he. What does he have? A third? I don't know about. Okay, uh, that was a pretty profitable was a miracle fusion. I'm not gonna lie. That one Ooh, that actually decreased yikes. to the strength of your board. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, oh you can no. cut that to malicious edge. Wait, why isn't this um? Oh, because I start the bet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, combos yeah, with itself. Yeah, place. that is so silly. Yeah. So silly. <laughs> so how do you think I feel? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my okay. God. Revenge. The hero's relentless revenge. Hero's revenge. Wasn't that a battle's of Oh, shit. What do you got? Uh, boy, just get like a fucking oh, mirror shot. force or something. I'm going to go exchange of night and day. I don't think it does anything, but I want to find oh, out. Oh, sure. We're going to send. I think the chaos uh, deck was pretty bad. You know? uh, yeah. Hmm. What do you think? Envoy this of was chaos Farfa's pull, right? This was his deck? No, this is, this is mine. Of all the decks I constructed, this is, this is the one I got. Okay, okay. It's okay. We're we're gonna we're gonna dial it back. I was never beaten heroes. We were never beaten heroes. It's payback, yeah. Heroes, pretty strong. Definitely really good. <laughs> oh my god. You know, crafting the URs for these decks cost me upwards of eight hundred dollars. I believe it. I believe it. <laughs> you probably shouldn't. Uh yeah, we'll give this one a shot. We'll get we'll sure. Jesus, the ads. Yeah, you know, write a complaint to Twitch. I don't tell you. It's always funny when people you, are like, oh, this is so fucked up. I got three minutes of ads. It's like, you understand that's the minimum we can set, right? <laughs> you know, there's actually Twitch, yeah. a mechanism by which you can avoid the ads entirely, Jeff. Yeah, five dollar <laughs> All right. Uh, I don't I don't know, man. Uh, go first. Show me what you got. <laughs> Okay, okay. That was just, I they were cook. giving me, what they were doing that last game, losing the heroes in one yeah. turn, they were just giving me the buff, which is, they gave me the justification to whine the entire episode, which is critical <laughs> to my strategy, which is whine the entire episode and then win. Yeah. 
Okay, let's go Resonator Call. Oh, jeez. Okay, this I remember this deck being insane. I remember it being bad. But okay, maybe well. it was pretty good. Let's add... I mean, with the Resonator Call, yeah, it's pretty strong. Oh, me um, going yeah. Resonator Call to Crimson? Ah, oh, this deck is so <laughs> good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah surely yeah. he won't have a red rising right i'm pretty sure yeah no <laughs> way oh i probably should have summoned that one right because that has a real effect okay let's go red rising dragon says, what do you think the resonator call sounds like probably something like ah what, what do you think it sounds like <laughs> that's what i think <laughs> you know they're resonating yeah yeah no it makes sense um, okay, let's go these two. Summon. All right. Summon. Oh, Dimax is in chat. All right, Dimax, just start typing out the combo now. I put my faith in your hand, sir. Go for these two. A dra little red dragon action. Jack Atlas is I'd here. really appreciate if you didn't just have all this shit. <laughs> like... Oh, my God. I can summon this guy. Does this do anything? Um, It is funny but no we'll probably make the one that's like good okay i synchro summon which believe it or not is a royal rare <laughs> fuck <laughs> come on <laughs> haven't i suffered enough doug nope uh, um <laughs> it's just like nope <laughs> <laughs> all right that's all i got that's all i got okay i'm gonna it's gonna work it's gonna work here we go hey, you got it you got it um, that is not a bad draw. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Ooh. Okay. Uh. Oh my God. It's okay. This is so. Wait, I don't understand the play here. Not familiar with the deck today? Someone no, I just, guard. um... Oh, okay, Crush Cards. Get the, uh, get the timer focus on. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, that's fine. Um... Other ice barrier moment. Okay. We'll begin by special summoning Evil Swarm Mandragora. Okay. Now, Douglas, you may understand that this Evil Swarm Mandragora is an incredibly powerful card. It's half of the Evil Swarm Ophion. You know, I will give you another opportunity. Would you like to use Abyss to negate this card? To negate the Mandragora? Yes. I'm good. If this is a Steel Swarm deck... Damn. I feel so bad for you. Okay. I don't think it is, though. There's no way you would queue up with Steel Swarm. I mean, that has to be one of the worst. No, it still works. Show. It still works. I will normal summon Raid Raptor Vanishing Lanius. Okay. That's pretty strong. That's right. It was Raid Raptor the whole time. You've been tricked, ah! you, you fucking fool. <laughs> you know what I mean? You moron! The absolute buffoon. <laughs> All right, I will activate. I was so tricked. Lanius. I was readying my Ophion out. You are letting it resolve. Well, hmm. yeah. I mean, you have a rank four on board already. I will special summon the Necro Vulture. The Necro Bulger? Oh, Vulture. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, this card sucks ass. Who cares? Yeah, go for it. Um, I don't think I've ever seen the Necro Vulture before. Not a not a Raid Raptor I'm familiar with. Okay, here we go. Time to rev it up. Oh my God, you're gonna hate this. Time to what do they say in Zexel? Overlay network? Are we entering the over... Is that what it is? Yeah, probably. You have not watched Zexel. You don't know anything about Zexel. Here, I'll, I... I'll do the Zexel chant. Yeah. 
Evil Swam Mandragora, you're going to be the bottom. Vanishing Lanius, <laughs> it's time to top. <laughs> I summon Raid Raptor Four Strix. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I figured. Okay. Uh, in attack mode? I'm going to attack. I have Zeus in here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Four Strix effect. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure you have extenders, but I, there's no way I'm letting that resolve. So, what am, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> do what you gotta do. Oh wait, you have the. Fool! I chain the effect of raid rank grumbler rank of magic revolution force. <laughs> yeah, what is okay? How many extra, Doug, this uh, Strix's rank? effect okay. is resolving, even if I gotta force it through. Yeah. What a revolution. <gasps> What's going so on? This is summoning what? Oh the my god. Attack, like, everything? The board is feeling so strange. Wait, what is this one? Oh, I've never seen this it sounds guy. like this is one you're unprepared for. A little stranger of a line than you're familiar no. with. No, oh my god. Oh, I removal, made... weren't expecting that, were you, asshole? I could have made Red yeah, Nova Dragon, extender, which right? can't be destroyed by card effects. That was the better play. <laughs> Strangle can oh, make wow. the three mat rank four. Dimax, we aren't playing that. <gasps> we are! <laughs> Wait, do we just win here? Holy shit. No way. Oh my god, I think no, we really do. Uh, through, okay. How do you OTK through the Dark Resonator? You built the deck, dumbass? Farfa built the deck! <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. A year ago. Farfa built the deck a literal year ago. Okay, was like let, me, let me do the math in my head. Okay, so we do this. We detached this. So we do this. Target this. Three, four. This guy. Detach one. Can the vulture tribute itself? <clears throat> oh, okay. okay. So the problem I think we're having here, chat... And once per turn is that we can only attack the dark resonator once dark resonator mvp jack atlas knew what was up we're always doing this um and we're always doing this yeah Kind of nuts, honestly. <clears throat> you know, we can even do this and maybe get a rum. Mm. Hey, what deck were you playing last game? Sorry. What deck were you playing last game? Oh, chaos! Right, 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 right. We saw yeah. the trap. We saw the trap. Yeah. Okay, I think I found the line. Wait, vanishing Lanius isn't a hard once. That's like super kind of them. <clears throat> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Don't tell me. These about cards it. are strong. I mean, they're just. I can right. see how I might be dead. I think I'm one I, guy I down it. though, right? Cause let me let me walk through the line. We do mm. these three for him, but then Necro has to tribute itself. And then what am I ranking up? Oh fuck. I think using this red sprinter is actually gonna like really fuck me here. Uh, 
Oh, wow. Okay, I didn't realize that we actually... Far Farfa, you did a good job. He was cooking? He he pulled some really fantastic cards. I didn't know we had that card. All right, so we're going to go Raid Which Raptor card? Rise Falcon. Rise Falcon. Um, Yeah, this is one that can attack everything. Oh! I will take your attack points here. Yeah. <clears throat> we will go... I'm going to take... Oh, I might be dead. Yeah, you are. Um... We're going to go Necro Vulture, Tribute Itself. Yeah. Grab really back. stupid that Revolution the uh, Revolution is not a once per turn. No, it is not. not. Sure uh, let's go... Cast <laughs> Strangular <laughs> Lanius. Yep. So that puts me to 48. Yikes. Rev up. Oh, doing this main phase one? Yes, because I want to activate the effect. Which effect? This one. Oh! And now we just go battle, right? <laughs> I feel like... Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, you know, I might have... <laughs> you got some? Okay. Okay. Sorry, game Farfa. I, I didn't realize you pulled Revolution Falcon. Thank you. You were that not familiar really with this game. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Room has been disbanded. What? <laughs> awesome. Wait, why did that happen? I, have I no wonder idea. if you can only have rooms. I, I think I actually do know why it happened. I think you can only have rooms open for 24 hours, and this was a room from yesterday. Um. But I'll send you another invite here. Um, yeah, we'll play this deck. <laughs> See what's you up. You seem really enthused about it. I think right. the Resonator deck might have been one of my worst ones. But I don't know what fine. the fuck I'm playing. What deck can I conceivably go first with? This one, maybe? <clears throat> And will you use all your URs for a deck? Um, we're probably going to film that. Uh, honestly, I was thinking about hopping on tomorrow, but it'll be what is posted the Saturday after this finale before the new show starts up to kind of give the finale some breathing room. You can go first. <laughs> yeah. You, yeah. <laughs> I'll take it. Roulette way. All right. Time to pray to the one true god. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Um, um, okay. Actually, this hand is not terrible. Okay, hold up. Yeah? Oh, boy. Unfortunately, it's just like... It relies on a little bit of the old RNG. Oh, boy. Yeah. God, I could go so much farther if I just pass, though. Yeah, there's just no way. Okay. Fuck. Wish it said or field. We're not going to get another opportunity to activate. Why is this in the deck? I'm going to have some choice words with Farfa. Okay. That seems strong. Yeah. Why don't we play? Come in? Zephros. Sure. I like that you got two dark winged beast decks out of all the packs on the wheel. I'm I'm in such a I'm in such a rough position on this. I just think this isn't realistic, chat. You would 
I'm trying to remember. Yeah, the thing is, I don't even, especially the Farfa decks, I do not remember which cards he pulled. Like, I have no idea if it's Kalut in this deck. Like, no, it is basically playing blind against these strategies again. You could have anything. Let's see what some of the rarities are. I know you all want me to make this card, but it doesn't do anything. Like, against 99% of the decks that Doug can bring, it does nothing. <sighs> Who the fuck is this guy? The alternative is we would add and then do this. Wait, this is actually a pretty good card. Never seen this one. I have faith actually, in the heart of the cards, actually. Yeah? I don't see... What is the RNG <sighs> that you could possibly have? Like, you got a danger monster? I don't, I don't understand. It's Sure. Nice. That's not bad. Oh, okay. Sure, 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 sure. <laughs> Do you get what you wanted? <laughs> Okay. Okay. Oh, come on. Let me see what rarity Kalute is. Kalute is, is a, a rare. It's a rare. No, it's so normal. that could conceivably be in your deck for sure. <laughs> well, oh, Let's I, start I can by just normal summoning. To oh fuck! Infernoid Decatron. Oh, this is a fucking. I'm supposed to win this one. Oh, I can't let you win with this deck. Oh, no. The, the, this is your deck, and the pulls were, I mean, just insane. Just unbelievable, man. Like, I'm so frustrated at how good your pulls were. It's crazy. <sighs> I'm I'm really having to face down all of my decks here. Ugh. Yeah, I mean, I think we just... Oh, I just fucked up. Oh, my God. I, I forgot about the... Okay, I can't do that anymore. I totally forgot about the, the literal Infernoid restriction. Hey, 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 uh, hey. That actually really sucks. Okay, well, we'll do this then, I guess. Unharmatic. Mm -hmm. Whoopsies. A little bit of a misstep. A little bit of a misstep. That's fine. Hey, chat, by the way, um, you all tell me to make Armor Master turn one? That play beats Armor Master, you dumb fucks. What if I just make this guy? Is that good? Seems kind of bad. Um, I don't know. I mean, it's damage, and I don't think the... Hmm. Okay. Absolutely right, sir. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bounced. Bet that makes you feel... <laughs> I feel like a fucking moron now. Yeah. <laughs> Gravity Warrior! <laughs> Damn, wait, is that a man? Whoa, that's crazy! <laughs> I better not leave any monsters in it. That better not be fucking Void Feast, dog. That had better not be fucking Void Feast. I swear to God, that had better not be fucking Void Feast, my guy. <laughs> that's what I was trying to get with the Black Feathers, by the way. That's the card I was hoping for. All right, let's see what's up. Where are my fucking Black Wings in my Black Wing deck? Well, you banished one, so, you know? You know, I think I have a really funny out. To Gravity Warrior? Uh, Let's go Pretty Vice Dragon. Guy. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. <clears throat> yeah, sure. Uh, I'm going to activate. Oh, that's not that's not once per turn. I could Zeph it back. <laughs> I'm going to go Black Warrior. Oh, one. that'd be sick. Okay, sure. That'd be fine. We're going to Zeph here. And didn't want to do it. Would have been an epic play. You could have been the first person to Zephyros a Vice Dragon, and you chose not to. Legitimately, I could have. Actually fucked up. All right. <laughs> Special summon Red Moon. This at least beats Gravity Warrior, right? Oh! <laughs> but you know what really beats Gravity Warrior, buddy? What is What is really beat it? Huh? Oh, oh my it's god! The poor what? <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> uh, 
Uh, get in there. Get in there, Obelisk. <laughs> is this less damage than if you just attack? <laughs> yes, yes, but it's Obelisk. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs> Oh, End phase. Oh, void, void launch is kind of crazy. Yeah. Draw for turn. Mm. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Does this card out? No. Huh. Um. I mean, this card eventually can deal with it. I suppose. Get rid of these two. Um, now, Chad, I know what you're thinking. Obelisk is just dead in the water to Anonku. But you forget that this is my deck. And, and you did not pull. I did not pull an <laughs> Anonku. Yeah, no, you did not. Okay, <laughs> let's just go. Anish to special. Yeah. Activate effect. Oh, no. nice. Okay. Um. Oh, that's actually hilarious. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, wait. That would destroy. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> 61, huh? <laughs> what are the chances, Doug? You put. Um, I've got a black whirlwind in hand. That's the only card you know. I really could do this. I really could do this. Like, what are the odds you kill me? I'm actually just not willing to risk it. I think this play might make people mad. Okay. Because the launch is going to kill itself. But I think this is oh, so no. funny. Oh no! Did I pull that I fucko? To do no. Yeah. All right, man. Go ahead. You do you. Imagine if I had Zeus there. That would have outed the obelisk. Oh. Good enough. Ooh, or... Okay, so he's crazy, but he could be... All right. Um. I don't know. Let's, let's go in, right? What if I just let it die? No, no, no. That's that's not the. That's not what we're doing here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Didn't have as much uh, gas as I thought. Well, yeah. I mean, you literally just had the well one in hand. Yep. Not bad. I'm not gonna get another opportunity to activate this card, chat. It's. <sighs> Zeus was about material. Well, you know, I would just summon my downward magician on top. I of shouldn't it. have I shouldn't have activated this because he's gonna be able to anonku it. I have to, yeah. Come on. Come Ooh, on, baby. You did. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> that was pretty good. That was pretty fucking good. Okay. Oh. Oh. Ha, ha, ha. All right, this is our that's our normal next turn. So we need a card that we can I mean it's got to be this, right? Like that seems like the play for sure. You just <laughs> you just card a black feathers into a galoot by banishing a galoot. I love that's it. That's correct. Yeah. All right. Hey, it replace it. I mean it was just upstart goblin basically. <laughs> it was functionally just upstart goblin. The hey, you can't special that. Get fucked. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> I draw. Now, Joseph, do you think maybe you played into a certain card by summoning this Kalut? Talking about Seismitas? Yeah, that's the one. Can you do a little math for me? What's 1,400 plus 1,400? Said that the card in your hand was the normal summon for next turn. I don't believe that you were Josh and me. Yeah. Okay. I think that's all we got in the battle phase, yeah. 
activate oh oh my god okay it's <laughs> there's two sides to its effects <laughs> at the end of the battle yeah it's this one no chain no okay <clears throat> um set go ahead oh god i mean your hand is like i don't think i have a target oh, for that gosh. as funny as it is yeah, I don't. We almost threw. We okay. slowed down. Um, we read the UI. It's the finale. I got to read. Ouster. Oh. Uh, who do we want? We. I didn't realize they had a card that comboed with the uh, Black Feathers. Kind of cool. Hmm. This is a thinker. This is a counter. So if we grab him, we can go this guy. Character development. Yeah, it only took me two years to start yeah. reading the UI, but we got there. Which one you got? Oh, Kalut? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Who do we want to add to hand? <clears throat> that's not very good. Hmm. Well, that doesn't Get do low. Anything. I mean, once you get to the 1300, right? Uh, actually, it maybe does do something, right? It's not like there's a six we really want to go into. Uh, oh, there actually is a six we want to go into, right? Oh, fuck. Can we kill him? Um, huh? Let's do some math here. Uh, plus. Hmm, what's that? That's going to be a seven. I mean, I know your deck has piercing, but I'm at 61. Hmm. The end of the damage step. I don't think this does anything, right? Just, uh, 20, uh, 25. That's lethal, but we're missing, we're missing a lad. Alternatively, we could special him to get to him. Oh, yeah. Is there something Working. worth normaling? There is in that guy. You have to draw it, though. Is that enough? So it would be... Let me, let me think of the line here. <clears throat> so good, to get good. to him, it would be... Four, five, six, seven. We'd special this. Three, three for six into him. Special the normal. Special back the tuner. And then that's four, four and four. It's a four tuner. A chat. A three tuner. Do you see the? Do you see? Do you see what we can do? I'm going to do that line because I think it's funnier. Um, I mean, what could be... I mean, you've already obelisked me today, so... <laughs> Who is this guy? Tornado the Reverse Wind. You know Tornado the Reverse Wind. Um, if there's a tuner in the... Oh. Okay. Yeah. Not bad. Did you pull an Armor Master? That is a big question today. Oh, armor Master is a rare. Oh! Okay. Luckily for that, I do have Void Seer. Ooh. That So is... I hope that messes up your plans a little bit. <laughs> that prevents me from killing you. And you do have a lot in the graveyard, don't you? I kill this guy. You I have... got a couple. Oh, you actually I wouldn't don't say have I have much. a lot, actually. Yeah, I'm about to say. <laughs> I think I only have Deviati and... Affected by, ugh, 26 is such yeah. a huge attack stat, too. This guy's That's attack is 1,000, so we can only get to... Uh, we can still make this work. Um, Yikes. Time Let's, for... Oh, for six? Okay. No thing the starlight. Oh, extra normal. Yeah, yeah. What rarity is this? You are? Fuck. Yeah, this one is the... The big pull for this.
Uh, I don't know. We'll click that. Even though <laughs> yeah, do you want to reduce the guy to zero or the guy that can't be affected? <clears throat> then we go. We can't make him. We can make him. He gets over, which is something. Normal tornado. Yeah. What do you mean I can't make him? Yeah, we can. It's oh, we're strong. locked into black wings. Ha! No Baron, idiot. You're right. Well, I kind of assumed that a black winged monster would be a black wing monster, but. Oh no! Me, no! 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 Okay. So, do we have no a guy way. that can actually clear this in that case? This crashes. Twenty six. Oh no! Is this this gets over. Beepy. This this gets over for sure. So we can go him to go big mode. The problem is he can just bring back the size Tomas by banishing the entire grave. Although we can prevent that from happening if we... Here, we're always doing this. Hmm. And we're always doing this. Oh, right. The whirlwind <laughs> still in a result. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Take it out. <laughs> what can you... No, I guess there's... Yeah, there's like Squall. No, I mean, they've really... Back in my day, well, and in Edison format, like once you got to the Blizzard, you're done. There's nothing lower than that. But they really give you a whole bridge. Yeah, Squall, yeah. sure. Free special? Oh! Oh, no, it's not effect. Okay, okay. I was like, wait a second. Battle position change, but unaffected, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be, be kind of dope. Though. Yeah, I was like, uh oh. These all have, like, zero defense. Hmm. This is super annoying. We have to do this, and then those two into him. Ugh, it's just such a crappy line. Yeah. Do I know the last card in your hand? I don't think so, right? Nope. Mm. This is a turn that started with the Vice Dragon, right? That is nuts, man. You've like really been popping off. Or I'm wait. trying. I think it was that turn. No, that was the Obelisk turn, I think. I don't know, man. I think this turn was just normal summon Oster. Yeah, yeah, no, that was the last turn. That was the last turn. Is this the, uh, oh. Dory the Dory. Rain sprinkling. I would like to take less damage. Attack. Oh, okay. Uh, am I dead? No. It kind of seems like I am. Oh, you just have that. Oh my god. Yeah, that's it. Holy shit, dude. Yeah, <laughs> tell me about it. <laughs> Yikes. Okay. Is that permanent? That is permanent. Oh. Um, yeah, we will do this. Unfairness. Oh, man. That is so rough. Holy fuck, dude. Oh, yeah. that's disastrous. <laughs> oh. Oh, boy. Okay. Activate effect. Mm -hmm. No, void launch. I think this is how this went a little bit when we played, but void launch is, like, insane. Yeah, it's a real, it's a real problem for me. I would say so. Um, yeah, <laughs> let's get rid of those. Little little Seistimus action. Yep. Are you dead? Uh, uh probably. <laughs> not, not sure. Pack attack. Pretty close. Go a ton. Oh, you drew a tondle for turn? Oh no, because I can't even no, this is just bad. This is just actually terrible. Oh, it does more damage, but um no, that's really bad because I forgot that the Seistimus is not 
it's at the end of battle phase and the battle phase mm-hmm. um that's fine that's fine who cares who need mm-hmm. who needs effects yeah i mean i still put you to like zero cards but mm-hmm. i mean that's not even true put me to one cards but i didn't have enough cards to banish for deviati so you know i guess it's fine in the battle let's go size to no chaining um, take that guy out and i mean that's what i have like 25 feeling a little bit okay tricky you know a little bit pushed against the wall here i mean that is <laughs> in terms of cards it could be that's i mean that is pretty much the best possible thing it could the have worst? been the <laughs> worst oh fuck <laughs> Uh wow. Oh, okay, Yugi, shit. you can draw, you know, some You know, good cards chat, here I there. I know what you're thinking. It actually doesn't. <laughs> okay. Um Blizzard the Far North. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And? And I'm going to activate its effect. <laughs> yeah, I mean, obviously you're like, you know, goading me into use one of these cards, but what am I going to do? Not chain it? Like, <laughs> I'm going to have to. Doesn't Doug just banish the target? Yeah. Obviously. Yeah, like, you know, like, you read the Inferno <laughs> I don't think you forgot that they were DD Crows. I think you got other stuff cooking. <laughs> yeah. In your graveyard. Uh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, I can't. I can't not. I can't not. I have to do it. Um, let's get rid of them. I still feel like, I don't know. I don't really know what you can. It seems like there's a thousand black wing extenders, so I don't really feel too secure here, but I'm not actually sure what you can do from this. It seems like you have like no cards. I don't know. I mean, good time to be Gladius the Midnight Sun. Huh? Oh man. Okay, okay. But that that is only level five, which maybe isn't too bad. Does this do something? Two five. Yeah, we go this card. That doesn't do anything. Um Yeah, I mean, it looks like the two level fives that you could have are not particularly strong. The level five can revive Rakiri. Rakiri's in Banish. Or uh, Kidori, rather. Pretty sure the level five specials from hand. Not great. I don't know what you're reading. Who cares? Hmm. We maybe just chill. He's got an eight. Oh, it says eight or lower, so he is going to get to bring one back, too. I think we might be cooked. Cataster? Oh, that's a good idea. Let's do Cataster. Huh? You have Ally of Justice Cataster? Let's go Keros. Are you... No way you have a link that you can... Find out. I mean, what can I do? Like, I can't do anything. So because yeah, it's lethal, so. It's lethal? Uh, what are you go going to summon? Ouster. <laughs> sure, Egg? No, it's lethal if you Atondel, is what I'm saying. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And now we're dead. Yeah, don't we don't think... have any guys. Oh. <laughs> we... Holy oh. shit, dude. Oh, man. I, I was totally supposed to win that one. Oh, now that was you, a close one. 
you have what well, you have what left in the tank? Well, I didn't win with the um Red Dragon Arching deck, and my remaining deck is Vampire. Oh shit. It's fucking Eldlich Vampire too. Well, this was your deck, so I'll tell you that um it only has one Eldlixer card. Oh, so okay. it's not gonna be you know, long-term Eldritch, probably. We are so cooked. We're so unbelievably cooked. We have to win two in a row, chat, and I don't, I don't know how we would do that. Uh, <laughs> All right. I can't believe you queued up with the Chaos deck. What's your last deck that is worse than that? <laughs> Who knows? Am I going first or second here? You're going first. Okay. Now, Vampires are absolutely a deck that the sequency matters a lot, and I am a bit afraid of screwing up more than once. You know, actually, I'm what's gonna... funny is that... Um, yeah. <laughs> maybe I should have just stayed on Obelisk that last game. <laughs> oh, this is not... I outed fantastic. it. What are you talking about? Well, yeah, I mean, if I shouldn't have ever summoned another guy. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. No, that, I mean, I wouldn't have an, that was the only out to it was the Systemus, so. Fuck. <laughs> I wish I had known that. Then the end phase. No, I think we just, um, chill with that. Go ahead. Looks good. Okay. Pretty strong. Um, Pretty strong opening turn. Wow. Hell of a draw there. All right, let's do some math. Um,. I don't think we're even developing this card, to be honest. Oh, we we literally can't. Okay, this this hand plays itself. Uh, Zeph. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what. <laughs> <It's> like, Zeph. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Is there something I need to know? No, I was just I was just reading. I was just reading. Reading the card I already know. Okay, that's not <laughs> a tuner. This is a tuner. That's Squall. Yeah. yeah. Oh, we could make this guy. <laughs> you can make the you can make black feather dragon here. I can. Card's pretty crazy. Oh, Anti burn damage. It is pretty crazy. It's all good. I mean, you can use the Blackwing deck again. He has he has to win with three different decks. Yeah. So, yeah. He doesn't have to queue up with that shitty Chaos deck again. But queuing up with the Chaos deck means that whatever your fourth deck is <sighs> is, like, worse than that, which I kind of, like, can't believe. Yeah. Okay. Um... I think here is a good. Uh, doesn't really do anything. I think that card's pretty good to get rid oh, of. Oh, oh, holy shit! Oh no! I can't believe you pulled this shit. Like, <laughs> oh no, that's not good. That is really not good. Wow, that's terrible news. That's as bad as it could have been. Wow. Not quite as bad as it could have been. Oh. Now it's as bad as it could have been. That's, uh, that's rough. That's real rough, buddy. I feel like I'm probably just dead here. Let's <laughs> just let's go. I don't know about that, but I will try to do some damage. White. White? <laughs> Fuck. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yep, okay. Let's go Vampire's Desire. Oh, no. Um, I think here I kind of want to be able to get hook in with some of this stuff. Is this the... Uh... 
I guess I don't really have a discard for this now I think about it. What should I do here? Mm, I mean, I could send... That seems like kind of a waste. I kind of want to keep the Frawlin on board. It's like a good card. Hmm. Um, I think I will... I think I just want to push for damage. Wait, do I have lethal? This can't be destroyed by battle once. Mm -hmm. I think I actually do have a line. Perhaps. Let's go vampire sorceress. Um, Sorcerer, actually. No. Normal summon grace? And then, you know, I was no. kind of burying the a little bit. But. <laughs> oh, no. This isn't even good. I don't even know, man. It seems pretty good to me. Oh, I'm going to be honest. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, doesn't yep. seem great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's not bad. It gets in there. I think I'm dead. I'm pretty sure this is the end of the game. What if I... What if you have double collude though? Yeah. What if? Oh uh, man. Okay, let's switch this to attack. I mean, we'll try. We'll see what's up. Um. Right. I mean, isn't that lethal? I don't know. No, it's not. This guy goes up to fifty-five. It's not lethal. I don't think. Well, wait, it can do it. Oh, it can do it on multiple monsters. Right? Yeah, it just keeps. It's able to do it a whole yeah. bunch of times, too. Yeah. Wow, that card's crazy. Yeah, Fraulein's nuts. Yeah. <laughs> um, jeez. Okay. With one final attack, GG's for all the master roulettes, Mr. Joseph. I knew it was over the second I rolled <laughs> Farfa's decks. So, what was your last deck? Heraldic, another Nadir oh, brew. Oh, right, right. I got right. four stinkers. I got four kind of stinky <laughs> ones. Oh, well. oh, my gosh. Okay, thank you guys for watching the Master Roulette finale after two years. Um, we'll be back in a couple weeks with another wheel spinning show. You guys love them, <laughs> and we'll keep spinning. See you guys then. Peace. Oh, my gosh. We made it. We did it Two after 10,000 years. Yeah. No, that was great. Thank you so much for participating in this. You know, I I, I tell my chat the story often of... Holy I, shit. I still remember being on the bottom deck of the Hartford um, Lake House pitching Master Roulette to you. And I was so happy that you agreed. I was so nervous. So oh, I'm God. glad that we're here. We made it. Is that where I said yes? Yeah, like I specifically remember that. I don't remember the conversation entirely. I was probably blackout drunk, we, but we I do remember asking. <laughs> um, okay, cool. So next week we'll you know we'll be back recording on Tuesday. I'll kind of run you through the the new rules. Um, I kind of got a master roulette one point five. I don't think I'm going to call it season two yet, mm -hmm. but um, we'll kind of see how it goes. So um, yeah, thanks for doing this. Have a good one, man. Yeah. Bye. What a nice young man. Any teasers? I don't know anything about it. I'm I'm as in the dark as you all are. All right. That took way longer than I thought it would. So we don't have a ton of time to do this other thing I wanted to do. Um. So instead, let's just make a game plan, okay? Uh, for the Danny series. So let me let me walk you through what the Danny series is and let me open up a notepad. Uh application capture? I don't know. What, what do I game capture notepad? Uh. Yeah. Check out this game, chat. 
This game goes crazy. It's not capturing it. It can't get notepad. It's like, what the fuck? Hmm. I can just do a, a screen capture. Okay. There we go. Can you all see this? All right. Okay. So the Danny series is going to be uh here's here's the plan. We're each going to start a new Master Duel account, right? And then we are going to have an hour total to build a strategy, right? We'll call it some kind of speed run name. So what I want to do before we get started, and then at the end of the hour, we'll duel each other. And then we'll take another hour the next episode, then we'll duel each other another. So that includes uh, building the deck. So I really want to plan for like 50 minutes. So real quick, here are the ground rules. You can't spend money at all. Otherwise, you just open packs for 45 minutes. The master of faster. That's literally it. Thank you. Wonderful name. Uh, VIP them. I'm not VIPing Offie. It'll go to her head. Uh, and... No, you can't purchase um, structure decks. The structure decks just ruin the entire concept. Like, there's nothing you can do. Like, if, if structure decks are allowed, it's just fucked. So, I want to come up with... You, you can purchase singles, yeah. MBT presents Master Race. Oh, that's actually it. That's what we're going to call it. Master race. Oh fuck, we can't we can't call it that actually. So um we load in, we play through the tutorial, we get X amount of gems. So first question is which of the structures we're starters we're getting. I think it's pretty clear we're getting the synchro one, right? Unexpected die, MST, a little too good to pass up. Uh and then what we want to do is either run directly into the secret pack like like uh play the minimum amount of games necessary to get the crafting material to get into one secret pack and burn the front loaded gems on that secret pack or we can probably get through a solo mode so Real quick, uh, the other thing is these three, dual training, dual restart, and tutorial, are off limits. Because they give you an insane amount of gems. What about the play ranked solo missions? Yeah, I think like there is an... Are there missions that give you an insane amount of gems early? Like play one ranked or whatever? Are the staple bundles banned? No. All right, let's see if we can, we can write those down. If you decraft a card, you get 50 SR dust. And if you craft a card, you get 50 UR dust from missions. That's good. Danny is getting the opportunity to play in with the chat. 
megalith. Can we get that just from the solo mode? Let's see what the megaliths look like. I think I think they're missing too much. It would take you too long to unlock the solo mode. Aren't the solo modes unlocked by default? No? Wait, which ones are unlocked by default? Monarch. Monarch and Element Saber? <clears throat> So I think I think we've got two paths in that case. We can either try to bum rush Monarch, Element Saber, Demise and Ruin to get to Megalith, which is like a playable deck. Or we bum rush the early gem missions, funnel the gems into the pack that makes the most sense, and then functionally craft an NR deck. You can probably win out more overall getting to Megalith this week. Won't both of you end up doing the same thing? Prob probably not, I'm going to be honest. Wiki has a list for all the missions. Can you link me that? If you play 10 solo mode du duels, you get 2,000 gems. Okay. Lifetimes. Win a duel in solo mode. Find a secret pack. Oh, fuck. You get a ton of gems for this. Banish your opponent's card, activate the... Okay. I I think solo mode grind is definitely the play. Solo mode grind to Megalith seems like uh seems like the play for sure. You should ignore the in-game rewards. Yeah, don't worry. We I think we What is what do the Megalith rewards look like?
Faleg. Hagith. Oak. Fuck. They are missing some. No fool. Is fool a UR? It's R, but you don't get it from that. But we can craft it after getting the gems from completing the solo mode duels, right? Okay. That's definitely the play. But I don't know if we can get there in an hour. Like, I think you all are really underestimating how long these take. Like, we would have to finish three of them to get to Megalith. Definitely, I think we are doing Monarch and maybe Warriors just for the money. And then we can pivot to just crafting a good deck. You only get the gems from winning with your own deck, though. What? Is that true? Oh, that's just the 200. No, for the missions, you can use whatever. Okay, thank God. I was going to say, because that fucks up everything. With our route. Okay. I think, I think this is a good, like, starting point. So we load in. We immediately go to solo. We clean out until we have a suitable number of gems. We purchase enough packs to get... We probably purchase a, a bundle. Like one of the 750 bundles. <laughs> probably the... The Lightning Storm one. We disenchant a bunch of uh, material in that pack in order to go back and forth. And then we go into one of the packs using the gems that we have. In week two, we try to make it to Megalith, then get the pack unlock from the, the final boss of that, and then try and build Megalith using the stuff in the pack. I think you're right, Offie. I think we're probably going to be playing, like, some kind of shitty Monarch deck. What if we tried to pull for Snake Eye? What if we did? What if we didn't? What if the world was made of pudding? All right. That's going to be it for me. We're going to do this tomorrow. We're going to go tomorrow. We're going to do Team Sam video. Saga this.